If there's anything we can take from the barrage of delivery drones to emerge recently, it's that the technology has the potential to transport objects with unprecedented efficiency. Graduate student Alec Moment from Holland's Delft University of Technology is looking to tap into this ability to reduce emergency response times to cardiac arrest incidents. His ambulance drone prototype carries a defibrillator to the scene and promises to dramatically increase the rate of survival. Receiving treatment quickly can be the difference when it comes to heart attacks, with every passing minute lowering the chances of survival. Although public defibrillators are becoming more common, they aren't everywhere and the public often doesn't know how to use one or hesitates through lack of confidence. Moment says that his solution can transport the necessary equipment to the victim and provide instructions to those in a position to help within a fraction of the time it currently takes emergency services to arrive. Some 800,000 people suffer a cardiac arrest in the EU every year, and only 8% survive, says Moment. The main reason for this is the relatively long response time of the emergency services, approximately 10 minutes, while brain death and fatalities occur within 4 to 6 minutes. The ambulance drone can get a defibrillator to a patient inside a 12 square kilometers zone within 1 minute. This response speed increases the chance of survival following a cardiac arrest from 8 to 80 percent. In building his prototype ambulance drone, Moment developed a new kind of UAV frame that incorporates a toolbox designed to carry medical supplies. He says technological advancements that have enabled devices such as automated external defibrillators, AEDS, to become more compact were critical in enabling the design. The drone's carbon composite structure makes it light enough to carry, while rotor arms that fold back allow it to convert into a medical kit weighing 4 kilograms, plus up to 4 kilograms of payload.